Fat Frog is channeling it there in our Miss Fujimoto. Uh, one, two, three, four, four, for Lindsay, one, two for Michelle, and one, two, for Gretchen, and there we go, there's another one jumping in for Lindsay, so it looks like we're going to be, um, Pairing up with Lindsay. Okay. Well, let's let's see what we can do, eh? Uh, so let's promise that. Oh, shame you can't promise both. Oh, get rejected for. Okay. It looks like he's definitely moved on from Michelle, and I've got to do another thumbnail. Oh dear. Yeah. I don't think that's uh, it's, it was still enough to uh, to change that. We'll stick with Lindsay. All right. Uh, you play for a little bit. You got to go to work today. You got to go to work today. All right. Oh, actually, you could work on your skills a little bit, couldn't you? You need body and you need mechanical. Uh, you're in a pretty good state. So, harvest, harvest. Study mechanical. Oh yes, we had that car that was stolen, didn't we? Yeah. Yeah, I think he's uh, he's fairly honest with his feelings, isn't he? Study. No. There we go, that's the point of mechanical skill you needed. And jump rope, easy, there we go. Let's see if we can get you a point of body. Yeah, get this nice new carpet all sweaty. Go here. And jump rope, easy, there we go. You've got no excuse for not doing it there. See you, Pasta. Thanks for coming along, mate. Oh, you've got a long way to go there. Let's leave you doing that. Let's uh, see what the kids are like. Uh, not in a good way. Right, you're up. Right, you know, have a good shower. That's a good idea. And after that, use that. And after that, do something that's fun. Steve, why don't you just play a computer game? There we go. Um, play SSX3. There we go. And you, when you're done. Oh. What should we do with you? Well, let's get yourself cleaned up. I know I'm using those the wrong way around. Come and watch that, and you had enough, did you? Okay. Breakfast, have some cereal, there we go. And if you have time, have some cereal, there we go. Right. Apparently you should cut your hair every six weeks. But I think that's just propaganda put out by hairdressers. See, before you go to work, Pull that with weed. Uh, 
think it will work. Wonderful, and then... There, I feel much better now. Is anyone else thinking it's a bit loud? Apart from that cutscene, it sounds alright to me. Off you go to school. Off you go to school. None of that done, did you? Hello, too many. Oh, we're starting to get a decent number of people here now. Okay, decision time guys, get your thinking caps on. Duncan is eating lunch at work when the office microwave begins acting unexpectedly. It waves at him and says hello. He's been tinkering with his microwave at home, but isn't sure if he wants to mess around with the work one. Should he try tinkering with it or call the support team? So tinker or support, what do you guys think? One or two, tinker or support? Miss Fujimoto challenging her in Miss Fujimoto and her outer one to be honest with you two two one one two there speaks the uh, the voice of experience from bit late yeah I think people are saying call the support team Duncan doesn't want to mess with the office microwave and so calls the support team. Someone arrives to help sort things out and begins a conversation about microwaves with Duncan. Seeing that they have something in common, Duncan invites the person over to hang out and chat about tinkering. Ugh. Oh, decision time! In art class, Tiara is told to paint an elephant. Chiara isn't the best painter of animals, so he considers painting an abstract piece instead that evokes an elephant. Should Tiara try to paint a realistic elephant or an abstract piece? <coughs> sorry guys. And sorry guys. <clears throat> Uh, I think, yeah, people are leaning towards abstract. Here we go. Abstract. Tiara can't paint an elephant, and he knows it. His attempt at an abstract elephant, however, is not much better. His triangular grey blobs on the paper look lazy, and he loses some arts and crafts enthusiasm. Well, it's not a biggie. Once got asked to paint in school, I once got asked to paint, um... What was it? A nightmare. That was it. A nightmare. And I didn't know what to paint, so I just painted the entire piece of paper black and just put two glowing red eyes on it. And I actually started, that was the piece of artwork that scored me the most. Ah, right. Right, they're both off to work in a little bit. Addie brought a friend home. Sell this off while I'm thinking about it. Now I really want to get you Let's harvest those quickly. I really, really want to get you to um, call a sim. Uh, you gotta have the right mind for it, I think. Alright, okay. Cool, Daniel. Just talk. And you, stop messing around with the computer and talk to your friend, because you've got low social. Uh, um, tell a story. Tell a story about computers. There we go. Oh, 
Not, not a man for his stories about computers. Okay, so entertain, tell a joke, talk, chat, uh, don't flirt, ask, what's your sign? There you go. Do when you're done before you go get the mail. And then go to work. And then go to work. Actually. Say goodbye and then go to work. Enough of that. No, I'm interested. He's obviously not into what's it. Astrology, that's it. Got rid of him. Mail. And then you get back to work. Pay the bills. Ah, good lord. Decision time. Three in a day. Tiara is just about to sign off on this year's yearbook for final printing when one of the editors makes a startling discovery. Somebody replaced the principal's picture with an image of a toilet. The joke could cost Tiara his job and all the students could face serious detention time. On the other hand, the yearbook is already over budget and the principal may find it funny, especially in light of the money that could be saved. Should Tiara recall the yearbook and edit the image? Or let it remain and hope for the best? Okay, so I think most people are saying recall the yearbook. Tiara places a call to the publisher and recalls the yearbook, then proceeds to phone the principal to ask for a bit more money from the school district's budget. After explaining the situation, the principal is livid. He doesn't care about the picture because in his words, he's not some silly child. The money spent to recall and re-edit the yearbook will cost the district a bit too much and some jobs will need to be eliminated. Tiara is fired. Whoops. Well, that's the end of his career then I suppose. Oh, he's been demoted. Yearbook Club Supervisor. No, oh, I thought he was that already. Okay, never mind. Right, you're stinky. Go upstairs, have a shower. And then... What should we do with you? Um, actually, what we need to do with you is do, is do your homework. So do your homework. There we go. On the bright side, he got demoted to the same job. It's not the end of the world. Duncan has bought... Why has Duncan brought someone who's barely through puberty? Uh, 
and barely clothed. Oh yeah, well perhaps your your son might like her, I don't know. Okay, so right. Let's get in here quickly and harvest these. Let's invite someone over, call out, ask out a date. Our chosen lady. Let's actually see if we can let's see if we can arrange an engagement here, shall we? Okay. Yeah, he happy. He big time happy. Okay, so we want to invite around Lindsay. Oh, I've got a question I want to ask you. There you go, you sit down there and enjoy the view. Why not? Sorry, do your homework. Why not? Yeah, that was a bit odd, wasn't it? He got demoted down to the same job after being told he was going to get fired. Right, guys, should we do it? Somebody's in the mood. Right, let's do this. Okay, this is going to do a cutscene, and this is going to be loud. So I'm warning you now, alright? More... More... Propose, there we go. No, not talk. Engagement, there we go. You ready, guys? It's time again. More for my niches. What's soon? The one that you can't see. Shabate! The most ya! Oh, the most ya! I gotta be honest with you, I've really, really missed these cutscenes in the later versions of The Sims. They are so good. Get married. We'll promise that. We won't do that immediately. Um, talk. Gossip. I tell you what, let's get a move in, shall we? Pose, move in, there we go. Oh! Why was that red? Three thousand simoleons. Right. I know what we're doing. Well, oh, thank you very much, money bags. Let's redecorate a little bit. Ah, that looks a little bit better. Let's put a wall across. We should be able to put a wall across. Oh, too close to Sim. Mm. I 
objects on. That should allow us to. No, it's not move objects, is it? Uh, but actually, that will do. Let's move you. And let's move you. Hey! <laughs> Looking pretty good there. Hey, hey, let's put that wall up. Now I wonder if we can move you back. No, it won't let me. Okay, never mind. Um, 